Michigan State University stepping up security at all of its sporting events. Changes start this week and they will impact what you can and cannot bring to games. 7 Action News reporter Brianne Palmarini is live tonight to tell us what's changing. Brianne. Well, Glenda, you used to be able to bring bags like purses and backpacks here to the Breslin Center for basketball games and other events, but now that's changing. No bags allowed at all, just like at football games. It's probably just a safety measure to make sure that nothing happens when you have such a large group of people in one concentrated area. It's very easy for something bad to happen. Students weighing in on the proposed upgrades to security say they get it. I think it's a good idea. The university released those proposed changes today. No bags will be allowed inside any event at the Breslin Center or the Munn Ice Arena, a policy that's already in place for football games. And they will be increasing their police presence at larger events like the football games. Students say while they understand the need for better security, some say it comes at a small cost. I know last year I took my backpack to a couple games because I was coming right from class and stuff. It's like it's kind of convenient not have to go back home and then all the way back. There was an unspecified threat to MSU at the big rivalry game against Michigan, but nothing came of it. I kind of thought it was just kind of like a prank from Michigan, just kind of like trying to scare everyone before all the games, but I didn't really think about it that much. According to the statement from MSU, the new upgrades aren't directly related to that threat, but to issues nationally and internationally. The university stated, quote, though there have been no specific threats made, police, athletic and campus leaders want to remind members of the MSU community to always remain vigilant and be aware of their surroundings. The new security efforts start here at the Breslin Center at Friday on Friday at their Midnight Madness event. And of course, you will notice that increased police presence at the home game here that Michigan's having. Of course, we'll have that on our, our air on Channel 7. Live in East Lansing, Brianne Pomerini, 7 Action News. Thank you, Brianne.